Hello everybody and welcome back to Battlefleet Gothic Armada 2. So, uh, we've got some stuff to do. We've got to pacify Chinchair. We've got to finish our mission in Medusa. Uh, I think that's the only other things we have to do right now. Yeah, nothing else, really. Uh, though we do have, I think, an inv yeah, we have an invasion coming into Medusa. Which is a really big Necron invasion. But I think Chinchair were fine, so we're just going to use this time to kind of re... Kind of, uh, repair and refit our ships a little bit. Before pushing into the... Maybe Chinchair system proper, or jumping here to the El uh, to the Eldar's system. Take that after they attack, then see where everybody else is. We might go down here and take that, and this one, and then go into Chinchair. I'm not sure. We'll see how they kind of waste themselves on various different objectives before we push in. But Medusa is going to be the big one that we've got to deal with. Uh, I think yes, we have an upgrade here. So this is a hive world and a shipyard, so we'll go ahead and upgrade you to level 2, so that gives our income a little bit of a boost, even though we don't really need it. Uh, something I am thinking about doing is this Imperial Fists fleet maybe dropping its ships to get a battle barge, uh, because that is a new thing that we can do now uh, that we haven't gotten on any of the other Space Marine fleets. And yeah, Battle Barge Mark 1 and Mark 2. So, Super Heavy Launch Base, Torpedo Launchers, Bombardment Cannon, Heavy Macro. So instead of Torpedoes, Heavy Lance Artillery and Lance Turrets. I like the Mark 2 better. So here's what we're going to do. We are going to get rid of the vanguards. We'll get rid of one of the vanguard. I don't know which one has the name of my Patreon, so we're going to get rid of both of them. Confirm. Confirm. Battle Barge Mark II. Put that in there. Put a Gladius. Well, you know what? Why don't we not put a Gladius? Why don't we just put another Vanguard in here? Nope, Vanguard won't work. Put a Gladius in there. Alright, confirm. And then we will rename this ship. Since we already have the Midge Man. Uh, as our Space Marine. Uh, we'll, we'll just rename a, another Space Marine ship after uh, Midge Man. And we'll promote him to flagship after we bring him to 9. Let's also make sure you're at 4.5. And there we go. That brings you up to a pretty big fleet. Yeah, not much else we can really do. Just gonna have to wait. So let's end the turn, see what happens. Okay, Chaos Invasion at Agrippina. Not a big one. I mean, it's a big one, but it's, it's not the biggest we've seen. Okay, Eldar reinforced a little bit. Necrons, what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, shifting things around a bit. Orcs, probably going to make another fleet or reinforce the one they've got. And yeah, they reinforced one. All right. This one will send back to Agrippina. Same with this one. We're going to we're going to start shifting around our Space Marine fleets to get the battle barges uh, on them. I'll keep you there for right now cuz we just need 
some more ships. Uh, Jabal can be upgraded. It's a mining world, but yeah, it's a mining world, so bring that up. So what do we got here? Is that a... Can't see it because it's blocked. Okay, 800 and 700. 4 and 800. 787 and 157. These three systems will be weakened by this next turn by a lot. So I'm hoping to use that to our advantage. Let's put minefields on these planets. Okay. Let's go to Agrippina. Put a minefield there to increase that four turns. And some defense platforms. Minefield there. Okay, and we're kind of just waiting for Agri... Well, can we build another battleship from Agrippina? No, we need two more. Okay, so th that's not that's not a bad thing then. We'll, we'll be able to do that. Might even be able to put Battle Barge Mark II in there. I'm not sure. It's, it's close. Uh, so, yeah, and then this one will have to pare down a little bit, but we can get some Battle Barges built and put into the ships, or into the, uh, the systems, or not systems, the fleets, there we go, that, those words, words, right guys, yeah. Alright. One more turn for you, you've been upgraded, well, you've been repaired, upgraded, and everything else we can do for you. Battle Cruiser, Cruiser, and Grand Cruiser. Battleship, yeah, yeah. Grand Cruiser, yeah. It works out. So we also have an Arc Mechanicus there. So we got two battleships, some Grand Cruisers, and Battle Cruisers there to uh, use on the Necrons. Once we fight this off, we, I don't know, we'll, we'll see what, we, what we're going to do here. We might go ahead and just push into Medusa. Well, we can't because Spire's got to go in there, but we could. We could just push in one of our other fleets claim this system. The only the problem is, is I'm not sure what that'll do for the orcs. That's the whole reason I've been avoiding it. There's probably been people, I don't know, not screaming in the comments, because I read all the comments and nobody's said anything about it here, uh, yet, but uh, some people might be saying, just push in to, the, to Medusa, take the, the planet. I don't know. If I take it and then the orcs start pouring out, that'll be another front. Eh, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, if if this goes well, then we might use these two forces here, these two fleets, and push them into Medusa, and then just, uh, yeah, go ahead and fortify the shit out of it, because it has strategic position. Yeah. Yeah, I can see that working. Unlocks chapter, looks upgrade. Cool. All right. Let's end the turn. And see how this attack goes from the Necrons. <sighs> okay, there go the Eldar. Ooh, they did a lot of damage to the Necrons. They repaired a bit of it. Put a new fleet down. Maybe, yes, new fleet. Orcs pushing in with a full-sized fleet. That damaged them a good amount. Are they putting a new fleet down? They are. But it has not been upgraded to, uh, or, or has not been reinforced. That, that'll be a neat. Chinchir and the other one might go this turn. All right. So we outnumber them by a little bit in terms of power. So what we're going to do is what we normally do. Battleship, battleship, grand cruiser. Now let's think about this. Mars. And then a couple of escorts. Yeah, I think that's good. Let's do it.
hopefully we can uh, go ahead and use our defense platforms as a good uh, line from which to draw them in to, and we can just hit them with Nova Cannons and everything else we have. Do think it's kind of bullshit that uh, we that when we put our mines down. I get I guess that when we put minefields down, it just delays them for a turn. But I would like it if they just couldn't have three uh, fleets. That'd be nice. Okay, it is a capture and hold mission, so we're gonna go ahead and push in here, take this third one, and then just hold these three. Is my plan at least. We wait your command. All right. Scouting, scouting. Looks as if these fighters are... I don't know if they're coming for us or if they're coming for the defense platforms. So what do we got here? We got a Plasma Bomb, Cybernetic Orb, and Augur Disruptor. Uh, okay, but we do have two Nova Cannons. I'm not sure how many... One, two... Three, looks like. Yeah. We got a lot of uh, strike craft. Okay, looks like they're coming for us. Race for impact. Fury interceptors in flight. You have there we go. A strategic <clears throat> the enemy has seized a strategic and area. We got a little fur ball going on right there. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and yeah. Enemy Once I got to their location, they then go to the nearest uh, enemy fighter craft. That gives us the ability of just hitting them with point defense and our fighters enemy to deal with sighted. them. All right, start turning that way. The enemy has seized a strategic area. Let's go ahead and have our escorts move that direction. We wait your command. Give me a couple of scans just to see what we see. Nothing. Okay, all the big boys are that way. Underway. Reloading. Go to the reload stance. Okay. I want those there. Bombers. We'll wait for everybody to rearm their strike craft launch bays. Which one's which? Cruiser, Grand Cruiser. We'll go with the Grand Cruiser. Your orders. Okay, there we go. All the Starhawks are being launched. All right. Okay, turn a little bit. Okay, yeah, he's dead. Ship ready. Okay, plasma bomb there. There we go. Screw up their sensor arrays. We lost the defense platform. 
Okay, we're targeting now. There we go. Firing the Novas. Come on, come on. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay, cybernetic orb away. That's gonna hit. Lightning strike successful. Plasma bomb there. Another one. Assault crews report success. Gonna wait on that a little bit longer for. Auger disruptor again. You have seized a strategic area. Come on. Starhawks loaded and sent. Okay, keep repairing these things. Lightning strike successful. Okay. Soul crews report success. All right, bombers are on their way. Come on, kill him. He's dead. Okay. Plasma bomb there. We wait your command. Okay, there goes Cybernetica Orb. Did a decent job there. Okay. Orders should do the job. Yep, he's not pulling out yet. You have accumulated 25% of strategic points. Okay. You guys will double back this direction to recap that point. Aye, Admiral. So he's trying to run again, but he's not going to. Come on. Assault crews report success. One more to deal with him before it's too far. I'd also like to launch auger probes, see what's going on that way. Come on. Yeah, it looks like a lot of small ships coming in. Fire that Nova Cannon and just kill him. Starhawks loaded and sent. Okay. He's dead. Your orders? Alright, everybody should be on there. Own targets. Mark, yeah, looks like a lot of small ships right now. We serve. Repair that. Starhawks Launch those bombers. Six. Your orders. Auger disruptor. Enemy ship crippled by the lightning strike. Okay. Strike successful. Launch that Nova Cannon. We wait your command. Execute Go ahead and do turn. a high energy turn. Fire your broadside into them. Ship 
ready. Let's just keep our boarding up. Aye, Admiral. There we go. Brace for impact. Maximum burn. Setting course. There we go. Good hit. Enemy ship crippled by the lightning strike. Standard Engaging. fire on him. State your order. And fire the orb. Good hit. Oh yeah. We're in for a ramming attack. We wait your command. Okay. We're doing fine. Let's do another bombing run on him. Starhawks loaded. Six seconds for you. You're done. I want you. Okay, there we go. We got that. And forward. Rally. Okay, he's good. Uh, let's see, can we get another... Got 15 seconds for the next of our... Auger probes are up, but we did have a scan ready. Starhawk there. There we go. Alright. I'm on. Transition begun. Straight down the center. Hit what you can. There goes the orb. Optimal course set. We don't have any engines, so this is calculating vectors. Kind of shitty. Yeah. With matchless efficiency. Okay, boarding action there. He's fleeing. All right, I'd like you to go that direction at full speed. Okay, we no longer have our deck, our generator, and we have light casualties. Boarding action there. loaded and sent. We serve. Let's do another bombing run there. Boarding action with them. Fire the eye of the on the side there. We wait your command. Maximum burn. Come on, battleship's going in. Coordinates acknowledged. He's mine. Course engaged. Acknowledged. He's running. You have accumulated 75% of strategic points. Alright, target him. Machine spirit appeased. Okay, some repairs there. Mutiny on board. Give me a rally. Okay, you can't do anything there. Give me a reload stance. Reloading. Head that direction. We'll repair you later. Alright, there we go. Cybernetica Orb. Got his engines. Your orders? Why are you at max? Go in. I want you in closer. 
No wonder you've been basically useless. Okay, and you're capping there, that's good. We are ready to serve. Alright. Do a normal boarding action there. Ship ready. Oh damn. Starhawks Bombing run set. there. Ooh, he's trying to disengage. Oh, lots of damage. Okay, he made it out. Your orders? Damage team. We'll repair what we can. You are close to victory by strategic points. Nice. We Can you serve. repair yet? There you go. Well, your engines are back up. You still lost your deck and you have heavy casualties. To serve the Omnisire. There we go. Cybernetic orb away. You know, at first I didn't actually much care for the Cybernetica Orb, but, uh... I think it's working pretty well. Engage Chrysalis Protocols! You have seized a strategic area. Alright. We serve! There we go, we got him. Oh, will the Cybernetica Orb hit him? Or... Oh, it's barely. No. Nope. Super close. Oh, there we go. I'm not sure if we won by uh, by victory points or if he fled. Lost his nerve. But there we go. That's a victory. And we didn't actually lose anything. We didn't even lose the es the escorts. I just realized that we did not lose the escorts during that fight. I mean, some things took some pretty heavy damage, like the battle cruiser, but wow, not and and the grand cruiser there, but not half bad. Light cruiser and escort got away from well, all these guys died. Light course, uh, light cr uh, cruiser and escort got away here, and a cruiser and a cruiser got out. Ah. But is dead. We did it. We need to remember as well, there is in three turns an attack coming into Agrippina, though we could just keep delaying that for a while. If we wanted to. Uh, we also need to go ahead and look at this guy. Can we put a... Battle barge into your fleet. Let's see here, Agrippina. Battle barge without the torpedoes, because I don't necessarily like the torpedoes for the um, space marines. I know you get boarding torpedoes with them, but their torpedo. The I don't ever remember to use boarding torpedoes anyway, and they're slower than strike craft, which means they get shot down easier. And their normal torpedoes, which is what you have to use if, if uh, you run out of boarding torpedoes, are they don't have they don't have any spread, so it's all just one line, so you have a higher chance of missing. Uh, I don't know, it's it, it's a preference. So let's get rid of the vanguard, and there we go. And can we put a gladius in there? We can. Confirm. All right. You're being programmed for 9. You're being programmed for 4.5. You're being promoted to flag. And there we go. Divine Duty. Ultramarine Battle Barge. Now that's not half bad. 
Uh, let's also go up here because I keep forgetting about this. Where is that Battlecruiser Mars? Okay, here it is. Yeah, you keep slipping through the cracks. There we go. And you at 4.5. 4.5. There we go. Now he has been upgraded to where I want him. Okay, he's pretty fucked up. You're easily destroyed, and so are you. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Let's look at this. You're not repaired too much, neither... Well, you're fully repaired, you're fully repaired, you're fine, and you're fine. So I think we're gonna start an assault in taking these three systems as quickly as possible, but we'll have to do that in the next episode. So, thank you for joining me for this episode. If you liked it, please leave a comment down below. So hit that like button. If you want to help support the channel, consider the subscribe button down below, as well as take a look at the description down below, where I have links to my Discord and my Patreon page. I'll see all of you guys in the next episode. Bye!